Hey guys, this is Nick and welcome to my Linux experiment. It's been almost a year now that I started this channel, and I've been amazed at how supportive all of you guys were. When I started, I had never edited a video in my life and had no idea on how to proceed. So I'd like to give you a little look behind the scene and show you how I create my videos. Writing. Since I'm not a native English speaker, I tend to write the whole script in advance. When I have an idea, I try to structure everything in Asana, a nice project management tool which I use to track the progress of each video. I always segment the video into bullet points first to make sure I cover everything I want to talk about and add structure to the video. It also helps me make sure that I don't rant for hours and that I stay to the point. Recording the audio. Once I'm satisfied with what is on the page, I whip out my microphone, a blue Yeti that works perfectly with Linux and I open Sound Recorder, the most simple sound recording app I have found. It lets me record, rename and delete recordings, that's all I need. I record each main point of the video in a separate file. If I stumble or mispronounce, I keep re-recording this particular sentence and fix it while editing the video. At this stage, I sometimes make adjustments to the written script to make sure everything is comprehensible. Recording the video. Once I have the audio and my script is final, I use OBS to record the video sequences. I keep Asana and OBS on a second screen and record each video sequence one by one, trying to follow the script as closely as possible. I try to switch wallpapers between each recording to add a bit more graphical detail and variety, especially when I only talk about one program. I tend to record two or three takes for each manipulation I do to make sure I have something usable. OBS is perfect for this kind of recording. I set it up at 1080p 60fps with NVENC to lower the CPU usage. Setting up the project. We then move on to Caden Live. This is a powerful editor that has a lot of nice features, transitions and effects. It tends to crash at times so I always save my work after a few edits. I create a project and select the presets, 1080p60 most of the time, and save it in a specific folder for each project. Inside the folder, I create a Sources folder where I dump all the audio and video. I then drag all of this material into the clip bin of Caden Live and organize it by type by creating directories directly in Caden Live. One folder for video, one for audio, and one for static images. Lining up the audio. I don't do much audio editing, just some gain boost to make sure everything I say is audible, and cutting the parts where I stumbled, or cutting the bad takes. I order each audio clip in the timeline and listen to the whole thing two or three times, and I re-record some stuff if I'm not satisfied with what I hear. Adding the video. I then proceed to drag the video clips in the timeline by chronological order. I trim and edit each clip to fit the required length and the things I'm saying, adding transitions to smooth out the edges. I try to use one major visible transition between each major bullet point of the video and a smaller, less intrusive transition such as a dissolve for transitions between sequences of the same bullet point. During all this process, I also add effects such as blur, zoom effects or even speeding up the video. Outro and titles. I then add my standard outro clip at the end of the video and make sure the audio is the same between what I recorded specifically for the video and the voice I recorded for my outro clip. On most videos, I like to add a title screen for each major bullet point. I create them in the title editor of Caden Life using one of my pre-made title backgrounds and adding the required text as needed. Each title is then positioned on the timeline and I add transitions to make them appear and disappear. Music. Once everything is done, I try to find a track to complement the video. I only use copyright free music I found on the internet or in the YouTube Creator Studio. I enjoy calm tunes with a little bit of a beat that adds rhythm. If the video is a bit long, I mix multiple tracks with fade outs. I align each track to the start of a bullet point. I then set up the gain of the music to make it audible, but with a low volume so the voice is not drowned. Final watch. Once everything is in place, I open the Caden Live monitor full screen and I watch the whole video. The preview is pretty laggy on my computer as soon as you have effects added, so the frame rate is more around 15 FPS than 60, but it's enough to see if everything is watchable and well edited. If I notice mistakes, such as an inverted transition, or a hard cut somewhere, or a sequence that does not really fit, I adjust the edited video or even re-record the sequence I need. I then re-watch the whole video a few times, insisting on the transitions and adjusting the gain on the music or the voice to make sure everything is audible. Rendering. 
Once I'm satisfied, I export the whole project at maximum quality in MP4 format. Can Live can take quite a long time to render a video, depending on the number of transitions or effects I added, ranging from 15 minutes for a 5 minute long video to 45 minutes for a 10 to 15 minutes video. When the rendering is done, I rewatch the whole thing, and at that point I'm pretty much fed up with the sound of my own voice. This seldom happens, but if I detect a major issue, I correct it and re-render the whole video again. So that's it for how I create these videos on YouTube. All in all, it's a simple process, ranging from 2-3 to three hours for a simple video, to 6 or 7 hours for a more complex one with a lot of transitions and animations. I hope you guys enjoyed, please let me know if you want more behind the scenes videos like this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! If you enjoyed, please consider liking, subscribing and turning on notifications. You can also follow me on Twitter at the Linux EXP. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.